And back in a jam-packed worldwide arena, Scott Hudson joined this week by the living legend Larry Zabisco as Lash LaRue makes his way to the ring and up and cover in the cruiserweight ranks here at World Championship Wrestling. And the rage and Cajun, you got to throw him in there with the likes of Blitzkrieg, maybe a Lenny Lane, a Mikey Whipwreck, the second generation of cruiserweights in WCW. Yeah, another one of the guys that are young and hungry, so uh, hide those uh, spiced up crawdads. He loves them. Well, look at that uh, that Tuesday of Mardi Gras. Bees has got around his neck. Be careful. The what? Those beads around his neck from Fat Tuesday in Mardi Gras, uh, uh, during Mardi Gras week in New Orleans. Fat Tuesday. Fat Tuesday, yeah. I thought you were talking about a blues singer or something. No. Scotty Riggs, I love you, baby. You all right? That's not what he's saying to himself. Oh, I thought you Char- said somebody else. Charlemagne used to do that. The great leader. Yes. Many thousands of years ago, used to lead his armies to battle, ride that big white horse, held up a mirror in front of his face, and used to shout as he looked into it, love you, baby. That's the attitude you have to have. If you don't love yourself, if you don't believe in yourself, don't step into that ring because some guy's going to hook you. Johnny Riggs demanding that referee Johnny Boone hang on to the mirror. I don't think that's in Johnny Boone's job description. Johnny Riggs getting a good look at himself. Probably looks the same as he did yesterday. He sure he does. Johnny Riggs, formerly one half of the world tag team champions, as part of the American male with Buff Bagwell. Now going solo after breaking away. Oh, hang on. Lash LaRue wants to look at the Cajun. There goes the mirror. That's seven years bad luck. Uh-oh, Riggs. Oh, did not like it. Tuck the clothes and I caught him up. Right hand from Scotty Riggs on Lash LaRue. Oh, man, tattooing him in there. I think Riggs has been around. He's not in there to look good. He may like the way he looks, but he's in there to win. Lash LaRue better take him very, very serious. Scotty Riggs certainly loves to look at himself in that mirror, but once the bell rings, as a highly accomplished athlete. Look at that monkey flip out from Lash LaRue. LaRue up. Whoa! In tight with a drop kick. One more time. Riggs begs off of the corner, and I don't blame him. Well, he stopped the momentum. Riggs is not, uh, you know, stupid there. LaRue is going back into that corner, but he was waiting to see if LaRue was dumb enough to rush in, too, and Lash LaRue didn't run in, so the kid's catching on. Certainly is. A lot of the legit wrestling media have high hopes for young Lash LaRue. They think they see something in the rage and cages. Now Riggs has him in the corner. Ooh, back elbow. A couple of them right in the jaw. Rocking Lash LaRue. Shoots him across. Hard hit. Big knee from Scotty Riggs. I mean, LaRue fell out hard. And uh, Riggs here is getting a little cocky. He's wasting time. Uh-oh. He hey, turned his back. One thing about these guys Ooh. like LaRue and some of the guys you mentioned are not the biggest guys, but smaller guys have a lot of endurance. They're not going to get tired, but man, if you kick him in the head like that, LaRue's going to be trouble. I tell you, there are those that say Scotty Riggs' drop kick may be the best in this sport. This doesn't have the world's strongest finger. That's exactly right. You're not going to pin an athlete in World Championship Wrestling with one finger, unless, of course, you're Hollywood Hogan pinning Kevin Nash for the world title. Well, even Rey Mysterio beat Nash. That's true. Kevin Nash is, of course, the world heavyweight champion. The man with the big target on his back, and it looks like Randy Savage has Nash in his crosshairs. Oh, oh hang on. Head scissors take over. He had uh, Riggs hair in between his legs there. And... Oh, oh. I mean, a spinning clothesline leveled Scotty Riggs sets him up Northern Lights float over into a pin attempt too and LaRue got the two count on Scotty Riggs yeah he hesitated for a minute that's a sign of confusion see that leads to mistakes like that LaRue went for the pin it didn't work he hesitated and Riggs did not jawbreaker rock and roll hang on reversal Riggs in ducks the clothesline from LaRue oh 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 the five arm nailed him right in the jaw Close it shut, Scotty Red with authority. Gets the one, two, three. 
Well, LaRue cried. I'm going to go back to the set. You have fun. And yes, sir. I'm sure Shivani should be well stuffed by now. Oh, boy. Well, thanks a lot, Chow. Living legend, Larry Zanisco, joining us here in the Worldwide Arena. I'll tell you what. Let's take another look at what went down earlier on. It's our Castle GTX replay. Castle GTX. Drive hard, and there you see what may be the best drop kick from Scotty Riggs with a head scissor takeover from Lash LaRue. Would that spell the end? No! That one! The five arm! The flying five arm from Scotty Riggs spells doom for the Raven Pages. Scotty Riggs wins it. Let's send it back to Tony Larry inside.